What is good guys, back here with another YouTube video, and in case you cannot tell by the title below, this video will be a video where I share my honest thoughts and opinions on Kenny Omega, the best belt machine returning officially to AEW as an in-ring performer for the first time in give or take nine months. I think it was in November of 2021 was the last time that he was on AEW television and I tuned in in a way for this moment kind of deal. I tuned in for Garcia uh, Danielson match, but the moment of Omega potentially returning was worth it and whatnot. And I put it out on Twitter that I had more than a couple of tears uh, rolling down my face because Omega was one of those guys for myself for a bunch of years, along with a lot of other people that... Uh, we all, or at least I knew that he was the best belt machine, best wrestler bell to bell in the world, in my opinion at least, and a lot of other people's opinions. And once uh, the stories of the injuries that he's had came out, I thought that not necessarily his career was done, but his career might be done if that makes any sort of sense he might have a match here and there kind of deal but it wouldn't be the quote-unquote Kenny Omega of old and just a little bit of context I'm recording this during the six-man tag or yeah six-man uh, tag for uh, the uh, trios titles tournament kind of deal uh, death triangle versus uh, the elite kind of deal and whatnot and Omega he looks okay kind of deal like physically okay like Kenny Omega's looking okay is other people's looking really good kind of deal he's wearing a shoulder brace on his left arm long sleeve shirt nor I don't want to say normal tights but like the good old-fashioned Kenny Omega bright colored tights uh kind of deal and whatnot and just like, this could be his one match, and then he retires right after, and I would be happy kind of deal, uh, and whatnot. Granted, it wouldn't necessarily be the best match kind of deal, or at least the first match I would want to see Omega have. But again, I would rather see this match over never seeing him wrestle again, and whatnot. And like I said, I'm recording this during the match, so I don't know for sure if he would win, uh, and whatnot. I'm assuming that he might, again don't know for sure and whatnot but for myself personally honestly it's so cool to see him back because for those who don't know I did not start watching AEW on a week-to-week -week basis until May of this year I would watch a little bit here a little bit there kind of deal uh, and whatnot mostly clips I would find on Twitter or YouTube that's how I would get my AEW content for the first three and a half or so years outside of pay-per-views and whatnot but being able to see Omega wrestle on TV right now, it's super cool, but also super weird kind of deal. And again, like, those nine months away sucked because, again, he was, in my opinion, the best wrestler bell to bell anywhere in the world. Not just in the U.S., not just he's the best wrestler to come out of Canada, but the best wrestler, in my opinion, in the entire world uh, kind of deal. And those nine or so months away from TV, from pay-per-view, I think he's still kind of sort of somewhat active on social media kind of deal i have no idea about uh being the elite uh kind of deal and whatnot but just seeing him on tv is super cool i assume that he uh assuming that he would wrestle somewhat regularly going forward it would be more of a quote-unquote part-time basis like one match every month uh kind of deal plus the pay-per-view and whatnot and spend the other three or four weeks of tv kind of hyping up that one tv match or that one pay-per-view and even with that i would rather take that over nothing kind of deal and hypothetically again if you were to say yeah my career is done and over with then that that would be fine too because there's more to life than just this wacky weird world of pro wrestling but either 
anyway, those are my thoughts and opinions of Omega coming back to AEW TV, AEW Dynamite tonight, the 17th of August, 2022, first time, I think it was nine months, I heard nine or ten months kind of deal, like I said, full gear uh, last year uh, and whatnot, but either way, that is it, would love to know what your thoughts and opinions are down in the comments below, while you are down there, feel free to hit the like, subscribe, turn on post notifications, of course, you don't have to if you don't want to, but it would mean a lot to myself if you did. More importantly, hope you guys are doing okay mentally, emotionally, and physically. The world that we tend to make up is nothing but a fantasy until you wake up. I feel like I'm just lying to myself. Lying to myself, yeah. Cause I just crossed the line like I'm playing offside. I do it how I want and I'ma do it till I die. I feel like I'm just lying to myself. But it's